What is up guys, welcome back to another video and today we're going to do a nice little short review on Bruno Fernandes. Um, team of the year Bruno Fernandes, just not, not forget that. So today we're going to cover the best position, how much he's worth, any alternatives and probably the best stat of, of the card that I thought um, uh, from playing the one game that I had. Um, I will play more games with him and maybe put a nice little update in the comment section below and leave a comment down below of what you think of this team of the year have you packed anyone have you saved any packs leave a comment down below because it really really helps me uh, to grow this channel so i really really appreciate every single one of you subscribe and like the video as well but anyways let's just get into the video and as you can see bruno fernandez team of the year is actually 4.8 million coins um currently of recording the video so Looking at Footbin, uh, the, the cheapest price is 4.82 million coins and 4.83. And the next one goes to 4.9 million coins. So he goes up and down, I think, and he will go up and down, especially when he's out of packs. I think his price will go up a little bit more uh, for a little while. And um, so far, what I've, what I've thought about him, you'll see in the first half how Bruno Fernandes plays. And as you can see straight away, we're playing um, a very good player team obviously with Cristiano and Ronaldo up top and I'm thinking please I just want to win one game so I can do this review to my family to YouTube family and look at this a Bruno Fernandes nice little foot a rainbow flick and then look at this volley come on just had no the goalkeeper had no chances at all so we'll quickly have a look at the goals that he scored and then we'll go into more of a stats based um, conversation so where did i play him so i played him in the right camp position in the 4 2 2 2 formation um, is that the best position for him personally i would like to play him behind the strikers in a different uh, formation obviously in a draft you can't actually choose which formation where you're going to play him so i personally like to play like two strikers and literally bruno fernandez right behind the strikers and i think that would work out like a treat and um, he could also be your box to box midfielders um as you can see here he's good at interceptions he's very very he's high high um he has high high attacking work rates he's good at interceptions his physical is 87 his defending 82 so he's, you know you can just work and play anywhere and as you can see they scored two goals and then um we will get his hat trick before the half time if i remember correctly and what a player he is look at this bruno fernandez terrible finesse with his left foot but just to let you know guys but i wanted to keep all of this in just to keep it as raw as possible so you guys just see um, what how he felt to have him in my team um but overall playing on the right hand side cam he did feel feel a little bit isolated so if you're playing 4222 i would reconsider of where to play him look at this just a very very straightforward finish um and in the second half the guy just came out of nowhere and started scoring goals which where we may have to make some changes um he's his pace he's got 90 pace um does he feel like, like 90 pace? I'm not really sure. I think uh, to, you would have to put a chemistry star on, on him to just to have the full advantage of um, this card. I mean, the people, the most people, the most chemistry star that's been used on this is actually Anchor and Shadow. And if you put a Shadow on him, um, I'm checking out Footbin on the, for this. So if you put an Anchor on him, he can be a 95 rated striker, 97 rated right winger. 98 cam 98 center midfielder 94 cdm 90 center back and an, and a 92 right back like he could just play anywhere apart from the goalkeeper of course and he just felt phenomenal like his ball dribbling skills are just the ball controls really nice really close to him which is what i like to see and um, this is where we made some changes um with with the formation i had to just do some tactics because the guy just came back at us and got three goals back and i'm thinking what do i do what do i do now i will show you like pretty much the whole end of the game which we can uh, talk over um after after this so what the, the other really good stat is the 97 shooting which is just ridiculous obviously i mean not had a chance to actually show you in the video but from a, from what i felt he was absolute absolutely phenomenal uh, let's not forget his shot power is 99, long shots is 99, volleys is 99, penalties is 99, uh, positioning is 99. You just 
you, you can't you know you just can't blame that and as you can see Neymar is going to get ourselves into the lead again we're playing 4-3 Bruno Fernandes not even involved in this one if I remember correctly and that's a, not a bad you know not a bad game to overall and I thought I'm going to keep this game in there because it shows a bit of everything we're losing we're winning and Bruno Fernandes doing a lot of things as you can see he does track back quite a bit um, to to help out which is really good and then, but then sometimes um, he could he could suffer in the attack um, he does have a stamina of 99 um, and which is again not a problem at all and he's got jumping of 98 if you put a, chem a, a shadow chemistry on him um, which is just a phenomenal as you can see Neymar did score another goal however he was offside which is a bit unfortunate but it is what it is um, Bruno Fernandes again um, would I buy him yes I would uh, if I had the coins I would definitely buy him um, if you if you're looking for an alternative uh, player then there is Bruno Fernandes player of the month card obviously there's quite a big difference uh, but it's very, it's still a very good card. Obviously, you, still, you also have Kevin De Bruyne, which is half the price. Um, team of the Year, Kevin De Bruyne, and you also have Kimmich, Team of the Year Kimmich, which is half the price as well, two and a half million coins. Um, at the time of recording this video, of course. So it's really important to just look around before you make a decision. Look at this run by Bruno. Uh, we did have a few good passes with Bruno Fernandes. A uh, nice little cross to Kane there. And then just Kane could not finish it with his head, which is very, very um, strange in a way because he was in a good position. And for Kane, with a header, that should have been a nice, easy finish. But we couldn't get the goal, which is unfortunate, but it is what it is. Uh, we're, still, we're still winning 4-3 and I will play the rest of the draft games uh, off camera just so I can uh, um, just so I can concentrate and get more packs out for you guys later on. As you can see Mbappe, not, he moves the keeper but Mbappe just does his own thing and we played really clever there. Uh, we actually didn't try to finesse, we just shot where, where the space was open which is really good. Uh, we will score one more goal with Bruno Fernandes um, but uh, guys just before that if you want to see the packs that are open up, I've got 164 packs to open up. Go follow me on Twitch down below. Uh, Twitch link is going to be down below. My bro, my bro Danes is going to be uh, streaming his packs tonight as well. So go follow him as well on Twitch. And uh, let, let's just have a massive Twitch party with loads of packs. Hopefully Team of the Year packed as well which will be pretty amazing if we did and uh we'll, but if you obviously if you can't get there that's okay that's okay we still love you um we will still love you and we'll, we can still see we'll make a video for you guys with the twitch highlights um with the best packs that we had and i'm sure danes will do the same so go check him out as well and as you can see we're now cruising into the wind quite nicely uh, which is going to be pretty sick uh 5 3 90 minute to go but Bruno Fernandes will score one more goal just to let you know guys and that's going to be a nice nice goal as well uh, so it's going to be four goals in one match playing as a right cam of course yes I did force the ball, ball to him quite a bit and uh, yes it is after it should have been after the whistle now because he should have blown the whistle but look at this Neymar on the left hand cam full on cross to the other side I meant to do that as well guys just to let you know and Bruno Fernandes scores the goal to win this game 6-3 97 Bruno Fernandes should you get it of course if you got the coins go and get him if you packed him keep him and if you enjoyed this video please leave a like down below it's been your boy PNT foot and I'll see you next time peace always do it on my own so I gotta get through it and the only thing I know is to love what I'm doing never give up never slow till I finally prove it never listen to the nose I just want to keep moving keep my head up when I act head up that's a fact Never looking back, I'ma keep myself on track Keep my head up, staying strong Always moving on Feel